It's been 20 years since Nashville was forever changed. When the trail of tornadoes hit back in April of 1998, Music City showed its volunteer spirit. Among those who pitched in, players with an NFL team who just made the move to Nashville. At the time, they were still known as the Tennessee Oilers. The idea is for an army of chainsaw-wielding volunteers to descend on tornado-stricken neighborhoods like Locust. The big assault will happen tomorrow, but it's already begun. <laughs> Members of the Tennessee Oilers are supposed to spend the offseason lifting weights. Today they were doing just that, but the exercise came from hefting large sections of sawed up tree trunk. We got our strength coach out here with us in this group right here. I'm telling them this got to count for one of the workout days for next week or something because this is, this is going to be some hard work. Clearly no one shying away from the hard work of cleaning up East Nashville and other storm damaged neighborhoods. Volunteer hotline, may I help you? MDHA is coordinating tomorrow's massive volunteer cleanup where more than 3,000 citizens have already called in to pitch in and help. Individuals, husbands and wives, Boy Scout troops, uh, church groups, youth groups, just large groups from companies, and then just neighbors are getting together calling and say, I got 15 people in a pickup truck and we'll be down. It's, it's unbelievable at the number we've had. <laughs> Organizers point out not everyone will be asked to lift heavy tree trunks. Some will simply clear trash and brush. But the one thing each volunteer is guaranteed to receive is a warm reception from tornado victims like Irene Lockhart. Oh, mercy. If I could, I'd hug everybody. Because <laughs> it's great to have help. Mark Drury, News Channel 5.